All right, Zero guys, two. so I should be in there. Please let me know if I'm not because I'm trying out this new, like, thing that holds my device for me, and I'm not used to it. I'm used to something else. So, anyways, oh, my God. I felt so good to be in the woods alone. Like, show one one. Show one one. Show one one two two. I love water. I love the woods. And now that I'm blind, I don't have as much access to that where I live, you know. And doing it by myself is really fucking hard and scary, but. <sighs> I found and I figured it out and uh, I had an amazing time. Show items one to three or three. I yeah, I was really proud of myself and uh I was just really touched uh, by how magical and mystical um, this earth is and like how we can um, tune in and I think I'm, I'm, I'm sad because it's like I need so much more access to this you know like uh, so <laughs> it was amazing and uh, so I, I found my way out of the woods safely. Show items two to four four. And um, then um, there were these two guys with dogs, and I ended up playing with their dogs a little bit. And then uh, one of them offered me a ride home. And I was like, you know, I'm just trusting in the universe. Like I was trying to manifest it. Everything just is like in divine flow. And so this, you know sweet Christian man um, and I gave me a ride home and asked me if I wanted a, an iced coffee on the way home too and I was like yeah and, um, and I don't know if you saw the pictures that's their dog so um, I got on the ride home I got like some awesome kisses from a dog so it's just like another amazing addition to my day like I got to go connect with the woods and the water and then the sweet human, and then I got the furry love, um, and then um, <laughs> as soon as I landed home, I was checking my thing, and somebody had said, hey, I'm near you. Do you want to get ice cream? And I'm like, hey, I'm not doing anything. Why not? Show items one, two, two. And so I Show items three, five, five. someone new and went out for ice cream, and uh, now I'm back home. So, uh, it's been a pretty beautiful day of, um, living my life. Um, oh, I don't try not to beat myself up because there's a part of me that's like saying, oh, I'm fucking off too much and I should be like focused and just working on this place, but as I also mentioned, like, my mental health and my emotional health, my spiritual health has not been doing good. And so, like, I've had to, like, like get back on track to get Candace feeling good about herself and good about life again. Um, and so, yeah, and it's been really hot. And now that I have access to the water and I'm meeting all sorts of new people and trying to just stay open you know, um, open to love. And when I say stay open to love, that doesn't mean hop, skipping and jumping into another intense relationship. You know what I mean? Like I am still, everybody that I'm meeting right now or I'm connecting with in any capacity is very well aware that like my heart is still with someone else and I'm going through this experience and I'm not really, yeah, I'm, but there's so much love and there's so many ways to celebrate life and celebrate love and let myself be loved, you know, like this person 
that just you know took me out for ice cream they were just so complimentary of me and you know saying how it's sad that you know I'm gonna be leaving and they just met me and and yesterday when I was walking down on Elm Street um, uh, I had a, a sweet experience with some stranger that said they recognized me they knew me they said uh, yeah, you're a model and you're a dancer and I remember you and you're a good girl. I'm like, oh, okay. maybe do I know them? I don't know. And so, and then they fell in love with my tattoo and they asked to take a picture of my foot and my tattoo and I let this stranger take a picture of my foot and my tattoo. Um, that was yesterday. They do. I don't know. But life has been pretty full and amazing. I have been working my ass off at trying to, well, not, at, at not sitting in my shit, you know, and allowing myself to have somewhat of a social life and try to build, even though I know I'm not staying here and I don't want to be here, like, I'm here now, and I, it'd be nice to have connections, you know, and I need a lot of help still, like, I can't, that's the other thing, like I started doing a little bit of work today on uh, making decisions and going through stuff and trash and sell keep stuff, but I really need a lot of help. Like I can't do this by myself. Like I don't even know what some of this shit is. Like I'm like, I'm looking at stuff and I'm like, I don't know, I don't know what this is, you know? Um, some things I know and some things I don't and uh, yeah. <laughs> mm. <sighs> I just want to run back out to the woods again like it was just so nice there oh. I wish I lived closer to the woods and water and you know like I yeah being yeah like Anyways, uh, really got to watch my fucking thinking. It's uh, starting to get a little negative. <laughs> um, and, uh, yeah. yeah so let me see what's going on with you guys. Who's saying what? You see, there are some friendly people in this world, and in New Hampshire, too. In this comments will appear here. Gina, Gina, button. Show me yes. three, six, seven. Yes, there you are. But it's still nothing in comparison to San Diego and O Beach and the lifestyle and the community and public drum circles on the, bre on the beach at least once a week. Like, whoa. You know, that's, that's where I want to be. Shonda Blotto is watching. Gina Chini, in other words, you are in frame smile. Show me item one of one. In other words, what? Shonda Blotto is Gina Chini, in other words, you are in frame smile. Oh, I'm in frame. Thank you. <laughs> Gina Chini, button. Gina Chini, hi Candace. Yes, I can see you just fine. Gina Chini, button. Wave. Seven Chewing is watching. Show me, wave. Gina Chini is watching. Gina Chini, enlist. Okay, so I think I got it all. Gina Chini, you see, there are some friendly people. Gina Chini, button. Mm -hmm. Gina Chini, New Hampshire doesn't seem like a bad place to live. It seems like a peaceful and safe place with cool people's slightly smiling face. Show me item six, seven, seven. You know, it's not that New Hampshire is horrible. Yeah, some people, it works, you know, and it worked for me at one point in time. It just doesn't work for me anymore. Make comment, text, figure out screen. Gina New Hampshire doesn't seem like a bad place to live. comment, text, figure screen. Live. So, yeah. Reasons, button, navigation bar. Um, yeah, there's a big difference. Mm. The culture and the humanity and what I have access to. Especially as a blind person, um, I need access to a lot more than what's available to me here, including there's three blind schools in San Diego that I can go to that have classes five to seven days a week. So, yeah, there's a lot more there for me. Okay. Bye, beauties. Oh. Back button. I don't... Oh, the finish button's covered by this thingy thing I'm using. Ah, hold on. I'm going to do this. I did it. Finish. 